Hey, it's Prickthar. Welcome to 1974. This is long before the minifigure. This is going to be a weird set. And it does not come with uh, Mr. Mustache there. Uh, but it is this nice little secretary's... Wait a minute, am I a secretary? It's a secretary's desk. Is that... Can we call people secretaries anymore? I can't remember. Well, technically I am a secretary, in a way. So, this is... An office, I guess. So this is pretty interesting. And it's not minifigure scale, so let me get the minifigure out of here. One thing about the Homemaker line, uh, the, the furniture, is they did a lot of studs not on top, meaning not that it's built sideways or upside down, but they always had a tiled, nice tiled top. Smooth finish, so you don't actually see the top. So that's not technically studs not on top. That's just smooth top, I guess. Tell me what the technical term is in the, the Lego community. All right, so let's go over what you get. You get this bookshelf, which is some tiles <laughs> with the books. Uh, the shelf itself is actually two, that's a piece, that's a piece, and then you got a couple of tiles on the top. So it's basically four pieces, and then you put the books. That's a one-by-one one brick with a blue um, tile on top of it. And these, most of these are tiles. A couple of them are one-by-two plates. And according to some of the inventories I've looked at, uh, the early versions of this set would have had the tiles without the groove and the later versions with the groove. So I think I actually got a mixture here. I'm not really too worried about it. All right, so this is 1974. So again, the colors are kind of psychedelic, <laughs> kind of not like what you would see today. So this white and red. Um, I don't, I can imagine what that would be like to see in actual real life form, you know, <laughs> uh, like if it was human, uh, chairs like this, but, um, that's the chair. Here is the desk. Now I do like this desk. It almost looks like a computer desk, except people didn't have computers back then, <laughs> but they did have this contraption. Do you know what that is? Is there some print on there? No, it's not. I can't read what it says. That is... A really high quality typewriter. Isn't that awesome? All right, and then we got this piece here, which is like a memo pad or notebook or something where they take their notes. Is there a pen or something laying on? I can't tell. I don't see any pencils on this. And then we got my favorite part the telephone. That is a rotary dial for those that don't know. The touch tone didn't come around really to the late 70s, early 80s. I mean, we still had a rotary dial into the 80s, I think. So that's just kind of an uh, 70s. Everybody had rotary dial. Oh, probably going to have to stop recording in order to get to... Oh, this is the drawer where you can put stuff in it. Isn't that neat? You can even play in it. Nice. So there's not a lot of pieces. Uh, I actually don't know how many pieces this set is. It's probably under 100 um, I'll show you the directions. This is what the directions look like. So you can tell me if I built it wrong. And sometimes there's things that are kind of vague. Like you can't tell on the instructions if they're using plates or tiles or a combination for all of those. You just have to kind of go by what the inventory says. But these sets were definitely marketed towards girls. I know because on the back of the instructions... It shows some of the other sets. You got that bureau there. This one, the piano. I don't know if I got that one, but I definitely want that one. You got the blue table and chairs. You got this little nursery. We do have the TV, the color TV. Color TV in 1974, pretty amazing to have. We still had black and white TVs into the 80s in my family. And then here we got a kitchen, a living room, a bathroom, it's got a toilet. And then uh, the bedroom with the plaid. Um. <laughs> so, anyway, this I, I, I don't think I got that set. I need to get that one. Pretty sure I got the living room and the bathroom. May have the kitchen. Uh, there's a couple of sets I need to get here. So I'm thinking about getting all of the homemaker sets. The thing that makes them hard to collect and hard to complete is almost all of them have stickers. Sticker, 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 sticker. Yeah, stickers, stickers, stickers. Yeah, there's stickers in every one of these, so it makes it hard. This one is probably one of my better ones as far as condition of the stickers. 
Uh, my typewriter sticker and my phone sticker and my book sticker are fine. I got other sets that's not nearly as good. But I talked a lot about this set. It's such a little set. I better stop talking and go on. It's funuary as I'm recording this. If you're watching this in 2027, I'm glad YouTube's still around. <laughs> Oh, man. And if you're watching this on April 18th of 2023, that's my 15-year anniversary of being on YouTube. So, yay! I made it to 15 years, unless this video's gone. Anyway, thanks for watching. This is Briggs R.